right, so we're here. So today we're going to do a pretty intense lower body workout. It's going to get your heart rate up as well. There are four different groups of exercises and within there, those groups there's going to be four exercises. So how this is going to work is we're going to do each exercise for 30 seconds, then we're going to move on to the next one. In between we have 10 seconds just to get ourselves into the next exercise. We're going to do each group of the four exercises three times. Then we're going to take a whole minute break and we're going to move on to the next group of exercises. So I'm going to post the actual exercises and the instructions down below. Now what you're going to need is not really anything at all. <laughs> um, definitely some energy. And I did bring some 10 pound dumbbells, which I will be using for rows and squats and things like that. I have my mat here um, and a timer. And other than that, that's about it. So unfortunately, I forgot to set the timer before I started the video. So I'm just gonna get on that right now. Um, so you can just set your timer for 30 seconds on, 10 seconds off. What is this? Four times three, 12, so 12 rounds. Um, and any timer will work. I just have some kind of timer app on my iPad, my iPhone, and my watch and stuff like that. So 30 seconds on, 10 second break, uh, 12 times. Oh, I don't have any music. The birds are chirping, that's great, right? Okay. <laughs> so the first exercise that we're gonna do we're gonna do a side lunge. So you can get in, you always wanna start with your base. You wanna have a nice, good base, and then you can kind of work from the top up from there. So you get your base, your feet are together. We're going to do a right side lunge, which is going to look opposite to you than my right side. <laughs> so I'm gonna to have to start getting used to calling my right side my left side when I do these videos. Anyway, uh, so you take a nice wide step and you want the weight to be on the foot that you just stepped out on and you want to push off that foot and come in. You don't really need that whole leg lift motion, I'm just showing you that I'm pushing off that foot. So again, right side, squat, up. What it looks like from the side, right side, squat, and back up. Then we're gonna do that to the left after the 30 seconds of course, so those are the first two exercises. Then we're gonna do a plank row. Um, so we're gonna get on a plank, <clears throat> however you like uh, so try and make sure that your bum is not like this try and make sure that your bum is not like that <laughs> you want to stay as um, straight as possible your spine in line and we're gonna row alternating rows for 30 seconds um, so this is why I brought the dumbbells you can use those if you like right after that we're gonna go straight into goblet squats so you want just a little bit wider than your shoulder width apart um, toes slightly turned out you can hold dumbbell or not and we're going to go down sorry dumbbell should be down here goblet squat and squeeze everything back up so again from the side that looks like down and up all right so that's it let's get to it i'll show you the rest of them uh, during our one minute break And the animals always like to lay on my mat. A squeeze. Okay, thanks. All right, here we go. So right side lunge, out and lunge. 30 seconds, you got this. Here we go. You should really feel it on the inside of your legs, your glutes, um, also your thigh and your quad. Okay, 10 seconds, keep her going. Nice. Really squeeze everything inside as well when you come up. Remember to push off that leg. All right, so we got 10 seconds, then we're gonna go into the left side lunge. So left, step out, squat down. You wanna watch your toe is not going too far over your, or sorry, your knee is not going too far over your toe. Let's go. Now really push off with that left leg. Again, you can add weight here if you like. You could very easily be holding dumbbells. All right, seven seconds. Good. 
Awesome, 10 seconds. All right, so now we're gonna do our plank row with alternating, sorry, plank with alternating row. So I'm gonna get down with my dumbbells. This may have been too much weight. All right, row, row. And the key here is to keep your stomach really tight and try not to move back and forth too much. Yeah, these were too heavy. So if that's the case, and down, keep rowing, squeeze everything on the top. You got seven seconds left. Awesome. There we go. Perfect. So now we're gonna go straight into goblet squats. All right. Feet a little bit shoulder width, further than shoulder width apart. We're gonna come down and squeeze everything up. Down, squeeze up. Awesome. Now you want to try and keep your head and neck in line with your spine. So don't be looking at the sky. Don't be checking out what's behind you. Just look forward. Up and down. Really squeeze at the top. Awesome. Good. So that is one round. Now we have two more rounds of those exact exercises. We'll grab a little drink. Here, I'm here, good boy. All right, so right side lunges. Really lunge into that leg. You're really gonna feel this. Awesome, good job. So again, you can add weight if you like. This is uh, my first exercise that's off of my plan that my coaches have given me. So I'm just gonna try and keep it pretty light and simple for myself. <laughs> All right, and keep moving while you're waiting too. Um, it helps, keep your heart rate up. There we go, left side lunge out. Really push off with that outer foot. Good, awesome. What a beautiful freaking day, I must say. Gorgeous. All right, we got 10 seconds left. Ooh. Awesome. Down, 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 nice and low. Squat, squat, squat. <laughs> Perfect. Shake it out. I'm starting to get a little, a little warm. <laughs> this is good. All right, so the next one's going to be our plank rows. We're not using dumbbells for this. <laughs> nice, sturdy. Oh, yes. If you need, you can go down on your knees as well. Right? And plank row that way if need be. Nice tight core. Try not to rock side to side as much as possible. Awesome. 10 seconds. Perfect. Tight core, tight, tight, tight core. That's where all the magic happens. Awesome, all right. Right up into goblet squats. So we have five seconds here. Good, here we go. And squat down and up. Good, really squeeze everything on the upside. Just imagine all those muscles really contracting. Good, good job. You wanna keep your shoulders back too. Don't let them go forward too much. Really try and keep them back. Keep your scapulas retracted. If you hear something, Sean just pulled in, so that's all. Here we go, four seconds. Perfect. Oh no, box. I didn't put on any bug spray. Also, I sell all natural bug spray. <laughs> okay, here we go. So, back into the right side lunge. Here we go, and really push off that right foot. Really squeeze everything up top. Good, awesome. I'm starting to really feel this. Here we go. Good, good, good. 10 seconds, here we go. Last round of this one. We're almost there. Perfect, 10 seconds, and we'll go over to the left. All right, so left side, here we go. Really squat it out. Bring it in, push off that left foot. 
Steve. Good, awesome. There we go. 17 seconds. Random time to look at the clock, I know. Push, push, push. Good, really sink into it. Awesome. Five seconds, here we go. Perfect. Whew. Good. Our plank rose. Here we go. Let's get ready. I'm gonna do them this way, actually. So, row. Alternating arms. Again, if this is too challenging, you can go down on your knees. If you have wrist problems, make a fist and then go from there. It um, takes the pressure off the angle of your wrist. Lots of modifications, so no excuses. Awesome. All right. And you don't have to bring your arm up too, too high either. You just kind of want it. You don't want to be extending it too far. Um, when you're doing a row, you just kind of want it pretty much in line with your spine when you bring it up. All right, so right into goblet squat, squats. Last round of these guys. We got a one minute break after this. Grab some water. Um, I'll also show you what the next four exercises are. And yeah. After that one, we'll be halfway through. Whew. All right, a 10 second mark here. Oh, squat and squeeze. Squat and squeeze. There we go. Perfect. All right, awesome, good work. So we got one minute. Um, take a little break. What time is it now? 6.20, so 6.21. All right, cool. So the next round, we got four exercises again. First one is going to be, sorry, the bugs are getting bad. Um, first one's gonna be sumo squat and pulse. So similar to the goblet squat, except we're going to have a wider base. Toes are gonna point slightly outward. You're really gonna feel this on the inside. So we're gonna do a sumo squat and then we're gonna pulse. Super squat. Pulse and back up. More challenging. Stay low and keep squatting. All right, so that's the first exercise. After that, we're gonna do a hold plank with a hamstring curl. All right, so we're back down on our planks. We love these. Hamstring curl, alternating. Right, left, right, left. All right, awesome. Again, come down on your knees if you need to. There we go. The next one that we're gonna do, sorry, there's so many bugs. <laughs> we're gonna do a burpee with four mountain climbers. All right, so burpee, down, feet go back, mountain climbers. Sorry, I should have done this from the side. There we go. One, two, three, four, up, jump, back. One, two, three, four, and up. Okay, if this is too challenging, I want you to come down and step. All right, and then you step back up and you come up. Don't forget your mountain climbers though. And then the final one, I'm laughing because it's just so much fun. The last one's gonna be plank jacks. So we're going to plank jack. Legs are going in, out, in, out, in, out. Um, you can modify that with toe taps. All right, I feel like we're well over a minute, so let's get going. Restart this timer. I might have to run and get some bug spray. They're black flies. They're really bad. All right, so sumo squat and pulse. Nice wide base, toes pointed out. Squat and pulse. Remember, more challenging. Keep the keep low and keep squatting. If you want less challenging, you can squat pulse, or you can just go straight through the motion. I am going to. Keep it nice and low and keep squat, keep pulsing. Oh All right, we got five seconds. Ooh. Awesome. Let's put your weight down, your old one. Next is the hold plank with a hamstring curl. So we'll do it from this side. And again, if you can't hold yourself up on your hands, you can do it from your elbows. Um, you can do it from your knees, whatever you like. I'm going full force on this one. So alternating hamstring curls here. Your tummy nice and tight, spine in a nice neutral position. Awesome, good work. There we go. We have 10 seconds. Countdown's on. Whew. Let's go. 
perfect. All right. Next one's gonna be a burpee with our four mountain climbers. That was three. Four mountain climbers. <laughs> Here we go. Down. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I may not talk too much during this exercise because it is challenging. Just know that you're all doing an awesome job. And we got 10 seconds left. Really jump, jump, jump. Awesome, good work. I'm fix my mat here. There you go. Okay. All right. Next one, plank jacks. Give that upper body a real go here. Okay? You know. Awesome. My heart rate is up. We got 20 seconds. If you need to, you can toe taps. If you need to, you can come down on your um Forearms or your knees. All right, keep her going. We got 10 seconds here. Let's do this. Awesome. Good. Whew. Good work. That was a tough round. That was very tough. So we're back to the top. Sumo squat and pulse. Let's do it. All right, nice wide base. Down. Just pulse it out if you really want to feel that burn. Just keep pulsing. Squeeze your glutes, squeeze your inner thighs. Got this. Here we go. 15 seconds. You really want to try and turn your knees in line with your toes. Five seconds. No. All right, good work. Now we're straight into these box. A plank with a hamstring curl. Let's go. Oh. There you go. Plank. Switch. If you have ankle weights, you could definitely put those on. It'd be more challenging as well. Good, good, good. We have 15 seconds left. Here we go. This is round two. Ooh, let's do this. I keep looking at my notes because as I get more exhausted throughout the workouts, I start to forget what I'm supposed to be doing. Um, so, just keep everybody in line. We got burpees. Here we go. One and four mountain climbers, of course. Jump, jump, jump. Out. Two, three, four. Awesome. One, two, three, four. Jump, jump, jump. One, two, three, four. Jump, 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 jump. Good job. All right. Now we got plank jacks. <laughs> Ready? Let's do this. All right. 30 seconds here, guys. We got this. Down to 20 seconds. But who's counting? Tummy nice and tight. Keep going, keep going. 10 seconds, we're almost there. Awesome, good work. One more round of that round. There goes button button across the lawn. Alright, so sumo squat and pulse, get your dumbbell, legs nice and wide, squat, so we got a squat and a pulse, when you come all the way up, do not lock your knees like I did, you just want to have a nice soft knee, okay we got 10 seconds here, oh, squat people, let's go, alright, Oh, good. It's our last round of these exercises. Next, we get our whole plank and hamstring curls. Let's do this. Hamstring curl, nice and high. Good, here we go. Awesome. 
So make these count, so make these count. Tummy nice and tight. Don't forget to breathe. Okay, everybody passing out. All right, we got five seconds. Perfect. Whew. I feel like I have an entourage of bugs around me. All right, next one is the burpees and the mountain climbers. Because <laughs> we love them. Here we go. Jump. Good. Four mountain climbers. One, two, three, four. Jump. Good. Mountain climbers. One, two, three, four. Up. Jump. One, two, three, four. We have 10 seconds left. Let's see if we can get two more in. One, two. Close. All right. Now we're gonna do plank jacks. So in out. Nice tight core. Nice straight spine. And your toe taps. If you get a little winded, go down on your elbows, on your forearms if you need to. We got ten seconds. All right. One, two. Okay, I have a bug problem. So, ugh. all right, so that was the first two rounds done. Congratulations, we have one minute and I'll explain to you what we're gonna do next. So, we got a squat jump. We're gonna squat down, knees, legs, toes, feet. <laughs> They're gonna be relatively a little bit wider than your hips. Uh, give yourself a nice base, squat, jump, squat, jump. These are killer. <laughs> so we got those. And then we're going right into jumping jacks. All right, jumping jacks. If you need to, jack touches. We got it all, baby. And then from there, we're gonna do squat kicks. So we're gonna do squat, stick your butt out, you're sitting in a chair, that butt out when you come back. Right, squat, left, squat. All right. From there, we're going into an alternating curtsy lunge. So I'll show you from the side. Eh, I'll show you from the front. So alternating, you're just gonna cross that leg in behind and squat down. And then switch. And then switch. Again, you can grab some weights if you wanna make it more challenging. And we're at the minute mark, all right, um, let's go. Here we go, so we're starting with the squat jumps. Uh, who made this up? Uh, all right, let's go, squat jumps. So squat, jump, you can put your arms up, you can jump like this, arms down, as long as you're getting some clearance. So if you hear my snuffly nose, is that time of the year. Awesome, get some air, keep going, we got 10 seconds. Good, awesome. Perfect. Then we got jacks. So jumping jacks, okay? Remember, if you need to modify it, we're doing jack touches. Let's go. Yeah, get it, get it. Kind of a nice exercise. Gets the air flowing around your body. Swatting those flies away while I'm at it. Alright. You got 10 seconds, keep going. Nice and light on your feet too, by the way. Keep breathing. Perfect, good, awesome. I may get a little winded. Just let me know. Okay, next one is the squat and kick. So, main thing is, squat down, don't round your back, it is a no-no. You wanna stick that booty out, right, left, right, left. You really wanna kick out from the heel. Just picture, I don't know, 
something you're not really into, picture of it. You just want to really give it the boot, hey? Perfect. Keep going. Awesome. Good job. Now we got our alternating curtsy lunges. Whoop. So I'm going to start with right behind left. And then we squat down. You want the weight to be on the front leg. There we go. You can add some weights if you like. I'll show you what it looks like from the side. Just alternating. Whew. Doing a lot of workouts. Get your heart rate up. This one's nice. A little switch. Good, good, good. Awesome. That was round. That was the first round. Gosh. I'm gonna pat in this dance. Fucking box. Alright, let's go back into our squat jumps. Here we go. Squat jump. If this is not in your cards today, squat up. Do a stationary squat. If you do want to jump, don't squat. Just jump. You know what? If you're feeling it today, you got all kinds of energy. Squat low, jump high. Awesome. Perfect. <laughs> we got jumping jacks. I'm just laughing at my cat laying in the window. Okay. Here we go. Jumping jacks. Keeps the bugs away. Let's go. Getting our heart rate up. Yeah. Soft, some nice and light on your feet. Don't lock out your knees. Be 10 seconds. If you want to make a statement, you can add a clap at the top. <laughs> Good job. Alright, next one is squat kick. Alternating left, right. That leaks. <laughs> I don't want to admit it because I like it, but I think it does. <sighs> Alright, so we're squatting down nice and low. Up. Don't walk out that knee that you're standing on. Kick from your heel. Really flex that foot back and kick. I want to see the bottoms of your shoes. Here we go. Eight seconds. Here we go. Good work, good work. <sighs> awesome. We have curtsy lunges and one more round of these guys and then our last round of exercises. Alright, squat jumps. Let's go. Awesome. Squat low, jump high. It's motto in this one. Yeah, land nice and soft on your feet. My calves are starting to give out. 10 seconds. We got this. Whoa, five, four. Good. Shake out those legs. Whew. We had jumping jacks. All right. I suppose. If you say so. Yeah. Good work. Okay, ten seconds. Let's go. Keep breathing. Perfect. Squat kicks. Yeah, I'm here for them. Alright. So squat. Pew. Pew. Sometimes I like to make noises. Pew. You know, like a cartoon character or something. Just let time go by. Add in any sort of sound you like. Alright. We have 10 seconds. Last round of these guys. Remember, don't lock out your knee. That you're standing on that leg. Alternating curtsy lunges. 
These bugs need to bug off. All right, I'm gonna switch sides. We're gonna start this side. Excuse me. Just really push her off that front leg. Weight is on that leg. Get down nice and low. Watch your knees not going far beyond your toe. All right. If this is not in the cards for you today, I should have told you this earlier, you can do a straight lunge. There we go. Wait, what am I missing? Squat jump, jumping jacks. I think I missed something. Cool, we'll just do all the knee currency lunges again then. There we go. Yeah. I told you as I get warmer, my brain goes a little mushy. There we go. <laughs> so you're welcome to call me out in the comments <laughs> for whenever I did this. I'm gonna go back and watch this and see what the heck it was. <sighs> All right, we got four seconds. <sighs> Perfect, there we go. <laughs> Third round done. What did I say, we have four rounds. Good, good, good. Totally forgot to set my watch. So does this actually count then? Like, did I do the exercise? Just joking. All right, so one minute rest. Grab a drink of water. Okay, sorry for my allergy snuffles. And my leaky shaker bottle. All right, so next one we're gonna do a squat punch. It's gonna be a sumo squat punch. So we're gonna get down nice and low. We're gonna hold it. Punch right, left, right, left. Try not to bounce, sorry. I know it's fun, but don't bounce. <laughs> so that's the first one. Next one, I love this one so much. <laughs> High knees. <laughs> High knees, up, up, up. If that's not in the cards today, just get those knees up. All right, just keep moving. And then after that, we have a plank. We haven't seen these since the beginning. A plank and, hang on, sorry and a knee tuck. Hmm. A plank and a knee tuck. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna alternate our um, mountain climbers. Instead of bringing your knee straight up, your knee's gonna go across. So opposite knee, opposite elbow, all right? So work those obliques in there. And then from there, we are actually gonna come down on the ground. And we're going to work a bit of our core. So we're gonna do V-ups, okay? So try and touch those toes, all right? Down up, whoo, down up. There we go. If that is too challenging, place your palm of your hands behind you and bring those knees in, all right? Really just trying to work the core here. So whatever is in your cards for you today, that's what you're gonna do. So I'm going to start this, we're going to start with a sumo squat, hold it, and uh, punch for all you're worth. Remember, hold, keep your shoulders back, shoulders always back, scapula, rotated. Alright, so we're going to squat, knees out, punch, right left, right left. Now do this with some oomph, don't just send your arm out there, do it, punch it. Go, go, go. There you go. If the squat's too much, you can come stand up. Keep punching, keep your knees nice and light. All right, we got five seconds. Perfect, all right. Now we're going into high knees. Cause those are the bomb. Here we go, high knees. Up, up, as high as they'll go. Again, this isn't for you today. Bring those knees up. Just keep moving. Keep moving. There you go. Awesome. Good work. Ten seconds. Ten seconds. Get the heart rate up. Yes. Perfect. Good job. From there. We're gonna do a mountain climbers, but we're gonna do opposite knee to opposite elbow. Really work those obliques. So we're gonna be down, opposite knee, opposite elbow. 
Now keep your back nice and straight. Um, don't let it curve up, don't let it curve down too much. Opposite knee, opposite elbow. Here we go. Keep breathing. Like 10 seconds. Oh dear. Awesome, good work. So this is my first video and uh, I know next time to put on bug spray. Whoa. All right, we're gonna do our V-ups. So again, you can place your knees down, bring your knees in. Or if you wanna go challenge, Ten seconds. Let's go. All right, good job. First round, we got two more. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so let's get up. <laughs> get down, nice and low. Squat punch. Let's go. Here you go. Yeah. You should really feel that on your inner thighs. Uh, your hamstrings, yeah, up nice and straight, don't be slouching, keep breathing, right left, right left, oh, yeah, five seconds, perfect, all right, shake them out, <laughs> next is high knees, Whew. breather, here we go, high knees, let's go. Hi, hi, hi. Good job, good job. Keep breathing. Keep going. I think I'm getting added extra size with swatting for these flies. Oh my gosh. Okay, last time I speak about them, I promise. Eight seconds. Good, good job. So we're gonna go down into a mountain climber, opposite knee, opposite elbow. If you need, uh, you can go down onto your knees and do this, instead of being on your toes. Now I look like this, opposite knee, opposite elbow. seconds keep breathing stay up if you need to you can hold plank as well oh perfect okay now we're gonna do our v-ups and then we have one more round of these all right here we go so these are actually knee tucks not v-ups <laughs> plan on doing V-ups, but uh, my abs are not allowing it today. So you do the best you can. Each and every day is going to be different. 10 seconds. Don't stop. Keep going. All right, good. Oh my gosh. We have one round. One more round. I don't think I missed any this time. <laughs> Alright, we're just punch, sumo squat, keep that low squat, lower, more challenging, punch, 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 you can have weights if you like, if that's your thing, brought them out, didn't use them, that's okay, <laughs> keep going, keep breathing, keep breathing, watch those knees, don't go far over those toes, there we go, we're almost to the end. Almost there. Last round of high knees. Here we go. Five seconds. Ready? Let's go. Again, I apologize if I don't speak too much right now. Heart rate is up. Concentrate. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Halfway there. 15 seconds. Awesome. Good. All right. 
right from here. We're gonna do our mountain climber. Opposite knee, opposite elbow. Really work those obliques. You can go as fast or as slow. If you wanna get your heart rate up, get going fast, very challenging. Don't forget to breathe. Smile as well, it always helps. 10 seconds. There we go. Good work. We have one more exercise. That is it. Then we have to stretch. It's very, very important. All right. So we're gonna do, oh my goodness. Whew. Here we go. Let's go, let's go. Last exercise, make this count. Make it count, you came here for a reason. Keep that reason at the forefront of your thoughts. 10 seconds. Come on, push it out. Awesome. Yes, just in time. Good. Right, right, I didn't have a timer going. What do you got up here? Oh, 41 minutes. Huh. Went longer than I thought it was going to. That's okay. That's all right. So, everyone, that was amazing. You guys did good. Pat yourself on the back. So, from there, grab a drink of water. Or make sure you hydrate, hydrate, hydrate all throughout the day, not just during your exercise. Now we're going to do a little stretch. All right, I'm going to focus on the lower body since that's what we did. Let's stretch those hamstrings. Sorry, I get distracted and there's a lot going on in the yard, AKA birds and bunnies and stuff like that. Anyway, so you want to put your right foot over your left and then scooch your butt back. And you really want to feel a nice stretch in your hamstring. You can rest your hand here don't really need to put too much pressure um, but the most pressure is in the foot that uh, is in the back really stretch 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 that out I'm gonna hold these anywhere from 15 to 30 seconds all right then we're gonna switch and we're gonna cross the left over the right and scooch butt back really stretch 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 yes ideally you would set a timer for you know, we'll say 20 seconds, kind of in between there, and hold these for 20 seconds. Okay, good. Nice hamstring stretch. One more. We're gonna reach up nice and high, nice and high, high, high. And then we're gonna hinge at the hips. And then you're just gonna come down and have a nice stretch in the back here. Try and get the weight in your heels and push your butt back as much as possible. Just go down as far as you can if you can get to here. That's excellent. Rest your hands on your thighs. Do not hyperextend your knees. We never want to do that. Keep them nice and light. Feel a good stretch in your hamstrings. All right. From there, we're going to stretch our quads. So ideally, have something to hold on to to stabilize yourself. Grab your ankle. And you want to keep your leg in nice and tight and get a good stretch. In the front here. If you're not feeling any stretch, you can stretch your leg out further if you like. Um, try and focus on one point if you don't have anything to hold on to so that you can keep your balance. All right, then we're gonna switch. Nice stretch in your quad. Did a lot of leg exercises today, so you really wanna give your lower body some love. All right, awesome. So from there, we're gonna come down onto our mat. I'll put pugs everywhere. We're gonna go into child's pose. So on your knees, stretch your hands out as far as they'll go, stretch, 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 while you're simultaneously bringing your backside back. <laughs> um, stretch. It's a good stretch for your back, for your hips. Awesome. 
Awesome. All right, so from there, we're going to go straight into cat cow. So you're going to look up, arch your back, and then really blow out the air, squeeze everything in. Breathe in, look up. This is a really great stretch if you've done any abdominal work or if you've done any back work. Really, really good to stretch out. Okay, perfect. Now we're gonna come down onto our bottom. Here we go. <laughs> um, so right foot into your left thigh. We're gonna stretch our sides here. So really reach over. Um, you're trying to get your right hand to your left foot and stretch, stretch, stretch. Feel a good stretch in your side here. Try and twist yourself up towards the sky as much as possible. Hold. All right, and then we'll switch. Ideally, you want to be holding longer than I am. Um, I just, unfortunately, I'm getting eaten alive right now. So we want the left foot to the right inner thigh. And stretch, stretch, stretch. Trying to reach that right foot with your left hand. And looking up to the sky. Keep breathing. Keep smiling. It all helps. <sighs> awesome. And back up. Cool. So put your feet together. Soles of your feet together. Bring them in. This is butterfly. Really stretch out your inner thighs here. We did a lot of work there today with all those sumos. Good. You can grab your feet and really stretch. You can lean right into it. You should feel a really good stretch in there. All right, perfect. Now, one more. We're going to do a runner's lunge. So a nice, really low lunge. And you just really want to get a good stretch on me. So my right foot is forward. Left knee is back. You should get a really good stretch in your left hip. This is super important, especially for people who sit at a desk all the time. Um, myself, really, really stretch, stretch, stretch. Then come into a barrel lunge, and you kind of want to sit back as far as you can, get a nice stretch in your hamstring. We're always trying to counteract anything that we do. So if we stretch our hamstring, you want to stretch your quad. If you're stretching your bicep, you want to stretch your tricep. Same with working out. So, realistic. so now I'm putting my left foot forward, really stretching into that right hip. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Really good. Shoulders are always back as well. Good, good, good. Then into a barrel lunge. Sit back. Forehead to knee. Stretch out the back of your leg. Very nice stretch. You can flex your toes as well for a deeper stretch, or you can point them. Awesome, all right. So we're gonna move up the body. We're gonna stretch our chest and our back a little bit. So collapse your hands behind you, pull down, and then up. Really get a nice stretch across your chest. You can also do this um, with your hand on a wall. We're in a doorway, really, really great stretch. This is excellent also for people who sit at a desk all the time. Um, people who sit at a desk all the time driving, you're always hunched over, you start to get a forward um, shoulder tilt there. So you wanna be careful. All right, so we did, did this one. Now we're gonna do opposite, clasp the hands ahead of you, pull and reach. You can round your back here and get a really good stretch in the upper back and your shoulders. Um, there we go. Cool. So thank you everybody for coming here for this. I really thought it was going to be a lot shorter than it was, but hey, who's counting when it's exercise, it's for your health, get you going, makes you feel good. I was honestly rather tired and I'm feeling a little bit more energy now. Um, a little lightheaded from the lack of blood from the bugs, but um, we'll deal with that. All right, guys, have a good one. Thanks for coming.